to say this though. Yeah, Have you ahead. ever been in one of those services where you're just like, okay, this was unexplainable. That's what last night was. It was incredible. If you tonight is the last night, if you are anywhere near Morgantown, Mississippi, Hattiesburg, Mississippi, Columbia, Mississippi, or know anybody that is within driving radius, you need to have them get into these services. We've not posted the pictures yet, but I'm going to tell you, it has been packed. Yeah, I've been sitting night. here like, oh my gosh, what God is doing and the people that God is bringing in, it's just, it's only the Lord. Yeah. So we're seeing signs, wonders, and miracles, and we are believing for a miracle for you today. As you're jumping on the PWOD, go ahead and share this, like this, share this, tag this, comment as much as you can, because what it does is it boosts the algorithm. <clears throat> I was, are you going to make Excuse it? me. Are you going to make it? <laughs> you sniffed too just then. Um, I'm so sorry. Um, but I was reading some things from um, the head of this social media organization, and oh, the reason why they are putting different blankets and censorships over things. So we can do this and get this message of truth and hope out with your help. So help us as much as Share, you can. Share, tag it, get it out there right now. If you're ready for the PWOD, give me a thumbs up. Tell me I'm ready for the prophetic word of the day. Go to Psalms chapter 119. Psalms 119, New Living Translation. I'm going to read verses 137 yes. through 144. That's where it's froze at. That's going to be the picture for today. Are you serious? <laughs> There we are. We are back. We are sorry. We are having some challenges with the connection sorry. this morning. Did Forgive you get, us. Get off Wi Fi. Um, well, I won't be able to comment if I do. Just go ahead because okay, it's, yeah. that's what it's going to do. Okay. So go ahead and get it off. Um, okay. All right. Um, I won't be able to comment, but we want to see your comments and then I'll be able to respond go. after a bit. People jumped off. Okay. And I'm sorry because we're having an issue with our Wi Fi right now. It says, Oh Lord, you are righteous and your regulations are fair. Yes. Your laws are perfect and completely trustworthy. And I'm overwhelmed with, with indignation for my enemies and have disregarded your, they, for my enemies have disregarded your words. Your promises have been thoroughly tested. That is why I love you so much. I am insignificant and despised, but I don't forget your commandments. Mm -hmm. Your justice is eternal and your instructions are perfectly true. So as pressure and stress bear down on me, I find joy in your commandments. Your laws are always right. Help me to understand them so I may live. Guys, we're, we're, we are in a situation right now where literally we're having to draw some lines when it comes to the kingdom. On Are we going to bow down? Are we going to do certain things? Or are we going to make a stand and say we are going to continue and do what we feel is right? based off the word of God, based off of our own personal convictions, <laughs> excuse me, and not allow pressure and stress to take us over. This morning, I, the Lord spoke to me and said, he said, the body is, pre is, is feeling pressured and stressed as if the world is bearing down on top of them. Now, I'm going to tell you something right here. And the Lord said, tell this to my people. Yes, it is real, but you do not have to participate. Yes, the pressure is real. Yes, the stress is real. And whatever your stress area might be, you don't have to participate in the way that the world deals with stress and pressure. Mm -hmm. Psalms here states, I find joy. Yes. And he's about to tell you where you're going to find joy during the pressure and the stress. Now, the psalmist writes about the commandments. Now, we are talking about the Mosaic law here. He says, your laws are right. Help me to understand them. Well, Jesus came to fulfill the law. So we are no longer under law, but we are under grace. But he has given us the great commandment so that we might, watch this, live in pressure mm -hmm. through stress with joy. Mark 12, 29 through 31, Jesus replies and makes this statement. The most important commandment is this. He said, listen, Israel, mm -hmm. the Lord our God is the one and only Lord. And you must love the Lord your God with all your heart, all your soul, all your mind, and all your strength. The second is equally important. Love your neighbor as yourself, for no other commandment is greater than these. If your focus is completely 
drawn to the pressure and the stress. You have nothing left in your tank to move out of there, mm -hmm. to move into the heart of God. Right. So you have got to command your spirit mm -hmm. to release all pressure and all stress. Give it to the Lord. And I, I, this is how I want you to see this. Pressure and stress will come. Mm -hmm. It's coming. It, it, it is coming. But I'm going to give it to Jesus. Yes. How do I do that? I'm going to follow your commandments because the joy of the Lord is my strength. And this is how I'm going to walk in joy. I'm going to love you with all of my heart. All right, I've got pressure and I got stress this morning. What do I need to do? Lord, I know there's pressure and stress. I know all this is trying to beat down on me. Lord, I love you. Lord, I praise you. Lord, I lift your name on high. You are beautiful and wonderful and mighty. And yes. I glorify you and magnify you. Lord God, I give you this pressure and I give you this stress. Just as David, he would be beat. I'm pressed down, but I'm not broken. I'm 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 pulled on every side, but I'm yes. not distressed. Lord, these things are coming in every single direction, but Lord God, I give it to you you because I am not going to get stressed. I will not allow stress to bring sickness into my body. I will not allow pressure to bring um, sickness and pain into my mind. So I am going. That was it. Okay. So sorry, guys. Chris's phone was actually still attached to it. And it I'm was so sorry. We lost everybody. We did. Um, here, but here... everybody's going to jump back on super fast. So, so here we are. I'm stressed. I'm pressured. But I'm going to pour love on you. And I'm going to heed to the commandments that you have given me. And I'm going to love the Lord my God with all my heart, with all my soul, and with all my mind. Yes. And I refuse to allow this pressure and this stress to bind me up. And keep me from walking in your glory. Well, and that's what the enemy wants to do. He wants to trap you with all these obstacles, with all this stress, with all this worry, with all this concern. And you know what? You're not going to change anything in your situations by all this worry and concern. It's only change is only going to come through prayer and declaration of the promises of God. So it, it's there. It's it's knocking on the door. Mm -hmm. Pressure is there. The stress is there. Lord said it's real. But you can choose whether or not, do I live? Mm -hmm. do, no, 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 it's not living. Living in pressure and stress is not living. It's living less than who you are. That's right. It's living less than who God's called you to be. Real living is, is showing people. They're like, how are you so happy? How are you walking in joy mm -hmm. right now? Because I refuse to allow the pressure yes. and the stress of the world bind me up. And keep me from walking in the fullness that God has for me. So right here, right now, here's what we're going to do. If you're dealing with this pressure and this stress, we're going to do this. Say this with me. Say, in the Lord Jesus, I give you pressure. I give you the stress of the world and I hand it to you right now. Yes. So that I may live under the commandment you, you have given me to walk in joy. For the joy of the Lord is my yes. strength. And I'm going to love you with all my heart, with all my mind, with all my spirit. Love my neighbor as myself. And I am going to refuse to allow pressure and stress to be a part of my life. Yes. I give it to you and I glorify you and praise your holy name. And I thank you that yes. you're my Lord. You're my savior. You're, you're, you're the, the author and the perfecter of my faith. Yes. And here right now, everything I do, regardless of what tries to come my way, Amen. I'm going to just love you. Amen. I'm going to praise you through it. And I'm going to tell you what will happen. You're going to get through it quicker. You're going to come out of it faster. You're going to learn whatever the lesson is. Amen. And God, you're, you're going to see the blessing of God hit you. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. We are sorry that there was some technical difficulties and some um, connection issues throughout this. Um, but you know what? God is so good. We're so thankful that many of you jump back on. Um, spread this word. Like it. Share it. Tag it. Inbox it. Comment it. 
you know, share the link over all of your social media platforms because someone needs this word today. Someone is carrying a load. Someone is carrying stress. Someone is carrying worry and concern. And they need these tools to be able to give it freely to the Lord or give it fully to the Lord. Um, also, pray and ask Holy Spirit how you can join with this kingdom assignment. All of the information is linked in the pin right there. It's chrisbrooksministries.com forward slash partner. You can give a one-time donation. You can partner with this assignment monthly and we have exclusives that are only for our partners so if you are praying about partnering with the kingdom assignment this is the one for you and we want you to be a part with us Amen. that information is on our website we love you we thank you we are so honored that you spend your mornings with us or your afternoons or evenings whenever you watch the replay um, follow us on all of our platforms on Facebook on Twitter on MeWe and on YouTube YouTube definitely go and subscribe there. We are only able to put our replays on our YouTube channel, but the more followers and subscribers that we have on YouTube, the quicker that we will be able to go live on YouTube as well. Amen. All right, guys, we love you. May the Lord bless you, and Amen. we will see you tomorrow. We'll see you in the morning. We love you guys. And hey, Pastor Corey, if you watch this, if it doesn't challenge you, it won't change you. Amen.